Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Whatever time y'all watching this hip-hop, what's good? Man, it's Marky Walker from Boston. Yo, man, we're going to Detroit. We're going to visit Ty Ferris, No Co-Sign, Just Cocaine, Part 4. It came on November 12th, 2021. It's about 41 minutes and 26 seconds. Now, there's various producers on here from around the world, and they tapped in. All right, number one, Slow Down, produced by Bozak Morris. This eerie, haunting track took less than a second for Ty Ferris to show how descriptive his pen could be in this game. Now, he talks about the cover. He talks about how nervous people are getting when they see that cocaine cover. Pretty sure you guys are nervous, but guess what? Relax. Just relax, man. Listen to the flow, man. Listen to Ty Ferris, man. That's all, that's all you got to do. Number two, <laughs> off with their heads. And that's what he's doing. I'm told, just relax. Just relax. You got to relax when he cut the head off. You know what I'm saying? So you don't feel it that much. You know what I'm saying? But off with their heads, produced by Wavy the God. All right? Track on some future soulful sound. It sounds like that. Like it's like from the future or something. But it sounds soulful. I like it. Um, is Ty Ferris lyrically underrated? I don't know. I'm going to say yeah, but guess what? Not in my book. I'm rewinding. I'm quoting. I'm playing this music loud. I'm putting his name out there, man. Ty Ferris asks at the end, what is a classic record? What's a classic record? Something that could be played throughout and something that is stands the test of time. You know, not everything's a classic like I always say, there's classic albums and there's albums with classic records on it. Now, you can have a lot of good records, but it's not a classic album. So that's my answer, Ty Ferris. But anyway, number three, You Should Be A Shame, produced by Black Milk. Loving this joint. This beat tougher than Run DMC's leather jackets. You know what I'm saying? He quotes on here, gun tucked like Al Bundy's shirt. <laughs> yo, remember Al? Yo, come on, man. I'm like, what? Shout out to Ty on these, on these verses. He's cultural. He's lyrical. He's the truth. All right? Also on number three, y'all in trouble, man. Flow tighter than Willie Nelson's headband on this joint, man. So you should be ashamed. Black Milk, love the track. Number four, Over, featuring Big Twin. What's up, Big Twin? Stop playing. Produced by Scene the Dream. And it's pronounced Seen the Dream. S E E N D A D R A E A M. All right. <laughs> These producers be having the, 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 I love the names, but they be like some crazy days. So, number four over high pitched Catalan Indo track is Fire. All right. Big Twins' mission, uh, you know, was complete as he came through and stomped on the package throughout, throwing some concrete bars on there, some hardcore bars. Ty wastes no time, no time adding to the hip hop with his verse. Like he's, listen, man, I'm telling you, man, he's just in his bag. And the way he flows, sometimes like, he, you know, he might, the, the first or second sentence, you're not going to catch what he's talking about until like the seventh sentence or something. You just got to put it all together. You got to listen to the, the whole verse and then go, oh, okay. Like, yo, Yo, I'm telling you, it goes over your head and then comes right back. So shout out to Ty Ferris on this lyrical wordplay. You know what I'm saying? So let's get into it. Number five, Scary Times featuring Mickey Diamond, Substance 810. Shout out to Substance 810. And Dango, is it Four Lane? Produced by P.A. Dre. Uh, track is insane. And P.A. works the sounds around all the features. Because, uh, like, you know, the MCs are rapping. And he's bringing it down, he's bringing it up, he's turning it off, he's doing all this stuff with the beat. It's just dope. Uh, Ty brings it home at the end and bodies his verse like Michael Jackson's zipped up jacket. Now listen to the verses, you understand my review. <laughs> Number six, brands of high quality. This is high This is all high quality, man, when he raps. Produced by Big Ghost LTD. Shout out to Big Ghost. Now, Big Ghost brought... The uh the horrorcore beat. Sound like a horrorcore beat. Y'all remember horrorcore rap? Uh he will be listen, Ty Ferris will be studied 
his lyrics will be studied in the hip hop hall of fame when it come out and they'll be studied in hip hop universities in the near future. I already know that it's coming. It's coming. We're studying them now. You know what I'm saying? Number seven, Sicilian defense. Listen, Stu Bangers, produced by Stu Bangers. Shout out to Stu Bangers, man. Stu Bangers is a, a very talented producer, and this joint shows it, all right? You weak as the battery that come with the toys from the factory. <laughs> Yo, Ty Ferris. Listen, I told you I don't even like the quote, but I got to quote Ty Ferris. I got to say something. Y'all got to go listen to this project and his various projects. This is part four. Go check out the other three and go check out his various other projects as well. Number eight, Suffer, produced by Spanish Ram. Shout out Spanish Ram. Very spirited energy record. Ty Ferris is painting 3D, 3D portraits with his complicated but respected verbal wordplay. Loving this. Loving these records, man. Number nine, Back Blocks, featuring UFO. Feeve, I love you, Feeve. UFO Feeve, produced by Finn. Now, I just got into production from Finn. Loving Finn. Shout out to Finn. All right. I can see Finn and Ty Ferris doing a whole project. Hopefully, that comes about. Track seems simple, but gives you a nostalgic feeling, giving UFO Feeve room to catch, wreck. You know what I'm saying? And the blocks might sleep on this one. But this song will grow on you because of the lyrical wordplay. All right. Number 10, Anonymous Millionaire. Loving that uh, title. Produced by The Standouts. Now, tempo elevates a little bit. Like a, like a lot of the uh, tracks are kind of, you know, um, slow in a sense. But this one got a little up tempo. So tempo elevates and sounds like it's going to switch. It keeps like, you're like, oh, oh, like it don't switch. But it's loops, giving Ty Ferris steady territory. To own his song. You know what I'm saying? That's it's just it's just dope. You know what I'm saying? Let's give Mr. Ferris his flowers now and not later. Give him his flowers. Stop playing. Catch up and catch up on his artwork. All right. Catch up. Listen to his word play. All right. I'm not playing. Listen, I only review good music. You know what I'm saying? Stop playing all right number 11 who really got your back featuring bub rock produced by bandit slice loving bandit slice loving the dope set sounds out the speaker go look up dope set d-u-l-c-e-t all right ty ferris is pinning lyrics that are as flush as this track bub rock has ties back on this song, you can tell he's murdering the track. Great verse, great feature, great song. Just a great track. Number 12, Run Through My Mind, featuring Elzai, produced by Trox, T-R-O-X. All right, like this producer as well. Hashtag Third Eye. He mentions the Third Eye a lot. You know what I'm saying? The Third Eye, right? Loving the vision. He's talking about future vision, this vision that's that's not foreseen, you know what I'm saying? You know, all black people got the third eye. Y'all know, y'all know what I'm talking about. But Run Through My Mind, featuring Elzai, produced by Trox. Another relaxing track, giving us clear volume to gravitate to pivotal lyrics from Ty Ferris and Elzai. Elzai didn't come to play on the mic. It's just dope. Just a dope verse by Elzai. Shout out to Elzai. All right. Number 13, Deemed Us Useless, produced by Nicholas Craven from Canada. Shout out to Nick Craven. What up? What up, Nick? All right. This profound and heartfelt track lets Ty Ferris create leg and headroom to get historically accurate on his past poor lifestyle. Loving the story. Loving that you're sharing and being personal with us in hip hop. Loving it. You know what I'm saying? Yo, he got his uncle. I hope this is his uncle. I don't know if it's his uncle, but he got his. I think it's his uncle. I don't know who it is, but somebody telling jokes. It sound like his uncle. Talking about he's naming the record. It's hilarious. Go check it out. You know what I'm saying? Number 14. 
Please like, subscribe, ring the notification bell, and share. Stop playing. I do this for free. Support if you can. My daughter's line and my clothing line. Number 14. This is for all y'all. Produced by Apollo Brown. Man, <laughs> this dude got elite producers over here, man. These producers are killing these tracks. So number 14, can we get an Apollo Brown Ty Ferris project? That's the first question. I didn't, say, I didn't even talk about the track yet. I just want a whole project now. You know what I'm saying? That's how dope this, this song is. And that's just how dope this project is. And that's how dope Ty Ferris sounds with Apollo Brown. And the other producers as well. He might as well just do a whole hour with, with all of them. I mean, I don't know. I'm going. I'm, I'm getting greedy now. I'm getting greedy, right? Um, this track is uh, uh, Breaking Jaws and Bones, man. Hip-hop accepts this 100%. We accept this track 100%. We accept this song 100%. We accept this album 100%. Uh, thanks for the growth and the vulnerability that you showed on this uh, album. And uh, shout out to 2021 Bars Over BS. That's, you know what I'm saying, who did the, um, the album. Listen, this album is a problem. All right? This album is a problem. Oh, yeah. Ty Ferris. Thanks for sending me the album sooner than later. You know what I'm saying? You sent me the album prior to it coming out on digital platforms, and I really appreciate it. We did this last year, and hopefully we continue to have a good relationship because hip-hop needs people like us to get this out there. You know what I'm saying? So, Ty Ferris, appreciate it. And, yo, congratulations to all these producers. Loving loving this heat. Loving all the producers on here. Loving the production. We coming back from Detroit, man. We coming back from Detroit. We getting back. We back in the bean. We back in Boston. Bean town. And I wore the colors for Detroit. These are the colors of Detroit. But guess what? These are the Boston colors, too. So, shout out. All right, Ty Ferris. I get up, man. Peace out, man. One love. Remember, love over hate, guys. And, yo. You know what I say? Come on. Bean town.